Hi there guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at how to install the router cam um, for Coral Draw, Coral Draw. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, we go back to the tutorial here. Um, yeah, so from the previous video, we just downloaded it. So make this a bit bigger. You can see here we've got the downloaded file. Now, um, in order to install it, it's rather simple. It works like most other programs. So you want to double click it. Then it's going to ask you that, um, that basically this program wants to make changes to your device. You say yes. And then it will start the download a prompt. Now under here, we don't have too many options, but we'll cover it nonetheless. Let me just see if my zoom in is working. It's a bit buggy at the moment. Okay, there we go. So first of all, we have um, here to the right, the version. or well, not the version, sorry, the, the, the um, basically whether it's 32-bit or 64-bit, that is the uh, motherboard. You can say more version or... Um, yeah, so in any case, so 32-bit is more for older motherboards. Um, otherwise, uh, x64, uh, it says 86 and um, 64, but this was for 32-bit, and this is for 64-bit. Uh, in most cases, you can just leave this at default. If you know what you're doing or you're running an older machine that you know is 32-bit, you can always set this to x86. Then next up, we've got um, Select Coral Draw Product. So this is the current... Um, Coral Draw you have installed, minus uh, Home and Student Suite uh, 2018. So you can simply select that and then installation folder, it will automatically direct it to your um, add-ons for your program. So you don't have to worry about setting that yourself. If you know where it is, you can maybe customly do it, but uh, this is definitely a way easier way. And next up, we wanna just um, select the I accept the license agreement. You can obviously show the license agreement if you wanna read through it. Um, but we're not going to be doing that for this tutorial then next up we want to click install now uh, the process should not be that long because it's not the biggest plugin it's only uh, just under 10 meg but uh, depending on your machine and so forth it could vary as well and then as it's done we can see it says at the bottom here success and then i would have liked the okay button but they just have a cancel one so um you know, it feels a bit dodgy saying cancel, so I normally just close it on top. Uh, yeah, nothing too serious. But yeah, that is it on installing it. In the next video, we'll be going into the program, looking where to locate it and so forth. But otherwise, in the meantime, um, if you guys head to softwaretraining.co.za, you will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover. And also you can isolate your search here on the top right. If you do not, however, find the training videos you're looking for, just simply go here, request a training video, fill in the minimum form, and then we'll do our best to try and make that for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching, and cheers.